Bruce has been tasked with two things. One perhaps more pertinent than the other. Percy Tau. Nearly. The first, of course, is to achieve certain milestones, i.e. qualify for AFCON. The second is to install a brand of football that is fast, fluid and offensive orientated, similar to what the Congolese were trying to do then and there. Decent defending from Mvala, shot from range, Ricardo Goss gobbles it up. Plenty of heat and venom behind the strike. Not so much precision. Decent hit from the captain. But Ricardo Goss had a good view of it. Congo now on the transition. Akolo. Morbi doing the defending. That's sublime. Vumpa. Still an opportunity here. Ricardo Goss makes his third save of the game. OJ. Democratic Republic of Congo. Basimula Jalo, Lebelo, Momotame Congo, Kaboy Tower, Kimotame Co, Yoitin Wabutalano, Mana Quilete, Leba Romela Cacuano Toko, Babata Jalo Mose, Fela Quilebe Mose, Lemose, Tolaga Quante, Fetora Jalo, and Tatelo, Ya DRC. Play resumes. Percy Tau goes short. Mindbella, back to Percy Tau. Plenty of hang time on the cross. Simvala with a good touch. Simvala squares. Foster! 1-0, Bafana, Bafana! South Africa strike swiftly. Lyle Foster, just like he does for Burnley, grants absolutely no mercy. Excellent maneuver from Percy Tau and Mayambela. But how about that touch from Mvala? Just set it up. And the Congolese defense failure to clear that ball. Allowed Foster to pounce on the loose ball. And he was never going to miss. Bafana Bafana finally break the deadlock. And he scores his third goal at the Orlando Stadium in 2023. 25 minutes in and South Africa have an early goal against their DR Congo foes and Lyle Foster started against Namibia perhaps very isolated against the Namibians but today he has all the support he needs and scores yet another goal in national colors Drops into that midfield just to create a numerical superiority, of course. Mayambela up against two. Sakelele Pasa is busting a gut to get into that penalty area. Innocent Mayela on the overlap. Here's Percy Tau. Decent first touch from Percy Tau. Good strike. But he was looking for the corner. Unfortunately, quite central from the El Ashley star man. Not much of a backlift, and he got so much power on that strike. <laughs> That's need from Foster. The flick to cross. Hits the side of the net. Nervy times for the DRC. That was just divine from Lyle Foster. 
who stretches it out to Percy Tao, who cuts back on the left foot, swivels, but Susiobas deflected, what a save, wow, what a save, but Susiobas going agonizingly close for Bafana Bafana's second. And he knows just how close that was. This is what Percy Tal didn't really do throughout the first half and much of the second. Cut back and he saw that late didn't pass it. It was a late reaction. A cat reflex-like 